Hi, my name is Tara Ross, and I get the award for most delinquent uh, VF group member. Um, I apologize. It's it's my bad, and I own the fact that this is getting put up so late, especially for those of you that like to get things done early. I've been flying back and forth to Massachusetts um, over the last 10 days where my uncle became really ill and died, and um, I'm just so sorry. I realized it this morning, and so I'm just trying to get this up as quickly as possible. Um, I am from Massachusetts, born and raised uh, just outside um, of Boston, and that's the mothership where they all drink Dunkin' Donuts and wear only things that say Boston Red Sox, Patriots, Celtics, and Bruins. Um, it is just the land of my people. But I left the land of my people and came to Salt Lake City in 2002 for a job and planned to stay for four months. I was in nonprofit management, and then I met two men. Uh, my husband, who um, I've now been married to for 15 years. We have two children, 10 and 12 and a dog that will definitely bark while we're talking, or while I'm talking. Um, and Jesus, I met Jesus, and that was a game changer, and all the things. Uh, ended up uh, becoming very involved in my church and have been working there for 13 years, and everything from service management to volunteers to kids' ministry volunteers to uh, everything but worship uh, team, which is um, a good choice to not do that. But my heart is outreach and compassion work. And so I've run our ministry in Eswatini, Africa um, since 2007. And I do all of our local outreach and volunteering um, here in the city. So um, if I had to get on a soapbox, I would talk about weird things. I little stream of consciousness problems sometimes in, in, in my brain. But something that might be appropriate is... Um, I would talk about the power of encouragement and um, as opposed to the power of discouragement in relationships and um, wanting a relationship more than you're wanting to be right and the power of words and how they can impact a person. Um, and, and I'd probably talk about what that looks like too in, in compassion and the difference between um, handing out a meal and sitting across the table from somebody and witnessing their story and encouraging them. Um, that's something I really love to talk about and experience and receive and hopefully offer. I just, I just think that's a part of our daily bread. So um, it's weird that this class, I've already taken 14 classes or 15, I think. So um, I've had some time to think about this topic. And so uh, of the CIQ and the and the rule of life and a little bit about vocation, having taken already all of the IS classes, and so I am, I'm 45, and I am so excited to just like kind of have that base and be able to think about this more. So I really look forward to getting to know all of you and bouncing off each other, and um, and sometimes taking this bit of knowledge about what vocation means and. And just turning it, turning another leaf over, um, and and trying to really dig in to understand how we apply that and what God wants us to show us, what God wants to show us about how we move forward. So, um, I've loved all the videos I've been able to watch already, and um, thank you for watching this. It's, I know it's a little long, and I hope that's okay because of my qualifying statements in the beginning. Thank you.